What's going on guys, Casual Savage in this video I'm showing you how to jailbreak iOS 7. So this jailbreak does work for iOS 7 up to iOS 7.0.4. So that means iOS 7.0.1, iOS 7.0.2, iOS 7.0.3 and iOS 7.0.4. And as you can see, it is untethered for iPhone 5S, 5C, 5, 4S and more with Evasion. Evasion is the program we'll be jailbreaking with, and there'll be a link to it in the description. So, first of all, you will need WinRAR. If you don't have WinRAR, there'll be a link to this video in the description, which will show you how to get WinRAR. Also, you will need the latest firmware of iTunes. If you don't have that, there'll be a link to this in the description. All you got to do is click download there. Also, you do need the Evasion link, obviously, and this is where it is. This will also be in the description. All you gotta do is click download now just to prove there is no survey. Click download. This should just do its thing up to there. And then it will download. And you can see there is no survey, so it's already downloaded. I've already got it there, that's why it's got in brackets one, so I don't really need to save it. So then once you have that saved, you can exit out of your browser, you'll no longer need it. And now you can just extract that. But before I get into that part, I'll just show you that my device is on iOS, yeah, iOS 7.0.4. So, so, as you can see there, it says version iOS 7.0.4, well, it just says 7.0.4. You can see it is on iOS 7.0.4. So now, let's get to the jailbreaking. You want to extract, actually, wait. Before you actually jailbreak, I would recommend you go to iTunes and back up your device. The way you do it is just plug your device into iTunes and click back up now. And that process takes about 5 minutes. So you want to start off with your device unplugged. And now we want to extract this. You see you get a program here which says invasion and it also comes with a readme which is just instructions telling you how to do the jailbreak and the copyright stuff like that and there is written instructions I'll also be providing my own written instructions in the description so first of all you want to run this Now you need to plug your device in. And easy, uh, then it's really easy, it's already spotted my device and you just gotta click jailbreak. Now I don't know how long this will take, it can take a while, so I'm just gonna fast forward all this part and then I'll be back to you when it is done. So right now it's just rebooting the device. So you can see on the screen it does say to continue, please unlock your device and tap the new Evasion 7 icon. And that is the one I was pointing at in the video while I was fast forwarding it. So, just unlock your device. iPhone 4 always laggy, I don't know why. And, yeah, there we go. There we go, so you just gotta press that once. And you'll think your device will reboot. So just press it and don't do anything else. Yeah, your device is now going to reboot again, so I'm going to fast forward this part and be back to you when it is done. Again, you 
can see here it says to continue please unlock your device so I'm just gonna have to wait for my device to boot back up um, you just have to unlock it so it's gonna lag again so I'm not gonna touch it yet and just leave your device again now you can see it is modifying stuff and as you can see the jailbreak is now complete on here it does say done so you can just exit out of that and now we just have to wait for the device to boot back up and you should see Cydia on your device You just heard the vibration that my device is back on. So now we'll go and check for Cydia. Just trust the computer. And there you go, you can see Cydia is now on the device if I just open it up. Just to prove it for you. Cydia on iOS 7.0.4. So as always, it's got the classic thing when it always is it at the start. And for those that still think I didn't jailbreak it with this device, my iPhone 4, I will show you again in settings general and about after this part has done. That's just saying my device is almost full. So I need to be deleting stuff if I want stuff from Cydia. That's something for you as well. Make sure your device has some space if you're going to be downloading stuff from Cydia. Mine's only an 8GB iPhone 4 so it's not that good. So Cydia has finally completed doing its stuff, whatever it was doing. Now I'll just show you again that it is on iOS 7.0.4. And it is the same device. Just put the brightness up a bit. So settings, general, about. Still says the same stuff as last time. And where is, there we go. 7.0.4. Don't really need much more proof, but it does work, so you go and try it out. And as I said, this works on any device that can run iOS 7 to iOS 7.0.4. Yeah, it's been Casual Savage here, actually, just before I go. Without my speaking and without the fast forwards in this, has actually taken me 20 minutes to do this video. And when I fast forward, it'll probably shorten down quite a lot. But yeah, that's just a heads up for you. So it'll take you around 20 to 25 minutes to do this. Yeah, it's been Casual Savage here. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe, rate, and peace. Play it. Just boob it. You know what? Oh, oh no. Whistle. No, Dylan, get. Dylan, get. <laughs> I've tried. Oh. What? <laughs>